Good morning, Saks Middle School. Welcome back and happy June. Today is Tuesday, June 2nd, and it is a D-Day in your schedule. Our quote of the day for today is only when normal things are not normal anymore do we realize how special normal things are. Very appropriate right now. Our next wellness tip of the day brought to you by Mr. Tisha and Mr. Orlando focuses on pedestrian safety with Officer Deke. Be sure to check this one out. You get to see some amazing detail that he has been on while he's not as an SRO in the building of SACS. And thank you to Mr. Tish and Ms. Orlando for continuing to bring important topics to the forefront on a daily basis. Big happy birthday shout outs for today, June 2nd. Go out to Juliana Giantasio, John Burke, and Madeline Kupchek. Happy birthday to each of you. I hope your day is a special one. All right, personal blowing update. Wednesday, we're going to have six green. Thursday, six red and six blue will be scheduled. And that gets us through 75% of the school. We're going on to seventh grade. More specific detail will be uh, shared out with uh, your team via email. But we will continue to announce everything here as well. So thank you again to everybody who has participated. I know a couple people who have uh, reached out for makeup days. Uh, we will continue to ensure that everybody's personal belongings are made available for pickup. So thank you to our crew. Thank you to everybody who's pitched in and thank you to the parents for um, being part of making this a um, great process as, as great as it can in terms of the large scale that, that it is. All right, grade A promotion. It may not look exactly like this this year, but we are going to make the best of it. Please look out for information coming out as soon as today on eighth grade promotion, some celebrations, some, some events that are being planned, and some specifics to each of those. So we'll be sharing that out here as well, but you can look for details in the letter that will be coming out. And uh, we're really excited about what we are going to be able to do to celebrate the Saks Class of 2020 and make it special for them because truly they're a special group and we appreciate everything they've done. And uh, we want to send them on their way in a positive light. So uh, look out for that and we'll make sure that we continue to share information as we go. Also newsworthy, we'll be sending out some specific information on the end of the quarter, the end of the school year, some important dates, as well as uh, grading and information that, that relates to the end of the year. So uh, if it's specific to grade levels, it will come out to you by grade level of team. If it is school-wide, it'll be sent out um, as a whole, but we will continue to, to include all updates in the morning announcements. Uh, we'll be communicating early and often, so look out for specific information for some of the questions that have come up. Hopefully, we'll be sending out all those answers in the next couple of days. A couple moments of gratitude as we go through coming out from the long weekend here. I want to thank uh, the Anchor family for sending in some birthday excitedness as well as Memorial Day excitement in front of Saks Middle School. Very cool that we got some pictures uh, showing the red, white, and blue in front of Saks there. Also to our building manager, Jimmy O'Hara, whose birthday was on Saturday. Happy birthday again, Jimmy, uh, and his entire custodial crew for the tireless work that they've continued to do throughout and clearing out the building and getting everything ready for people. I was in there yesterday and I saw James down there in uh, one of the courtyards, and my gosh, look at that. You know, it could be look like the grounds of Yankee Stadium. Uh, they truly do care about the building, the grounds, and have done such an except exceptional job of maintaining everything. And uh, it's just nice to see the building and, and how well it's been treated. So thank you to uh, everybody who's been in the building and taking care of everything and, you know, working behind the scenes and on the front lines and making sure everything is moving forward. Also, some moments of gratitude uh, from over the weekend. You know, I thought this was certainly noteworthy. Um, you know, it brought me back to hearing stories growing up about the great space races before, you know, I was around. But and then watching the space shuttles take off uh, when we were younger. But to see the first manned um, space launch from U.S. soil take off this weekend truly was a proud moment. Uh, if you got to check it out, I'm sure you, you felt some of that. National Pride. Uh, if you haven't checked it out, make sure you do. It's really neat to see that they were docking with the International Space Station and uh, just some positive news that's come out. So it's pretty neat. Also on a personal level, uh, you may or may not know, I like to get out and uh, get a quick jog in in the morning. I feel like it sets me up to have my mind ready to take on whatever the day comes in, uh, brings in. And uh, yesterday on my morning jog, came across this big fella. 
I am so happy that the old adage uh, that my parents would always say, don't worry about, uh, you know, animals. They're more afraid of you than you are of them held true in this case, because as you can see, he was running the opposite direction on me. Uh, but it was pretty neat to see. First time I've ever seen a black bear out in uh, out in the wild, if you will. I was on the way to the park up the road and uh, it was pretty neat to see. And he, you know, he was uh, respectful of social distancing and kept on his way. So pretty neat to see and thought I'd share. If you have anything uh, that you'd like to share that's spirit related or moments of gratitude or showcasing anything uh, during the e-learning experience, that, or if you have any ideas in this last couple weeks here you want to share, please make sure you reach out to Mr. Rosick or myself. In the meantime, you are invited to find your flag to prepare for the Pledge of Allegiance. As we go through our parting thoughts for today, which are remember to try and do your 50 push-ups today. Got mine in earlier, which is uh, PE tip of the day. Remember to be safe, uh, safe pedestrian. Follow along with the tips from, from Officer Deke and have a terrific Tuesday.